The protest, which started in one town just over a week ago, has now exploded across the province. From the west coast to the Wildlands district, the Overberg and now the Breda River Valley, farming towns are on fire. In Wolseley, protesters torched vehicles, overturned a police van and looted stores. Police retaliated by opening fire. At least one person was killed. In Cirrus, farm owners survey the damage to a fruit packing plant, while firefighters responded to a blaze on the Chaidu Pass, allegedly started by protesters. Western Cape Premier Helen Zilla has called for the army to be deployed. She says police, law enforcement and disaster management officials are too thinly stretched on the ground to deal with the violence. So when you haven't got enough policemen, or when the situation gets to the point that the policemen that they are can't do their job for whatever reason, to the extent that it is required across a wide enough area, that is when you bring in the SANDF, and that's what we're doing. A joint operation centre has also been set up in Cape Town to monitor and respond to violent protests as they reported. Lester Kivit, Cape Town.